The Adventures of Ruby 2. Sumanula. Crossroads of the galaxy. Three moons. A hot sun. Some water. Dirt. Some automated cities. Some nomadic cities. And a lot of backwater towns. Yeah, Sumanula. No one pronounces it right. It's really Samanella. Means the high point of nothing. That pretty much sums it up. Shadows moving up over the glass walls. Hmm. There are some sort of creatures behind it, but I can't see what. Are you, uh, Ruby? A little rat face was staring up at me. My name is Kapoor. Rodant Kapoor. So? I have a job for you, Ruby, too. Mm. Sit down, Rodent. Rodant! Not Rodent, Ruby, please. There's one. I knew there was something behind the shadows. Something... The substance. Yeah, plenty of vile. Lens. Feet. Let's move. of action. Uh oh, dead end. I'm trapped. Yeah, oh boy. Suspense. Big money. We're talking big money. Mm, good. Who's hiring me, Rodent? Rodent! I'm not at liberty to say! Yes, you are. Put me down, Ruby! Who is it? The Bull Dada! The Bull Dada? The Bull Dada! Mm. Shadow sliding along the black ink. Damn, this floor is slippery. Whoops! Ow! What? A glass memo cover. <laughs> Cold. Translucent tubes running down through the glass walls. If I can just slip in. Yeah, and slide down through the tubes. And see what happens. So, uh, you will take the job, Ruby? Oh, I'll think about it. This will be quite interesting for you, Ruby, too. <laughs> I hope so, Rodent. <laughs> My name is Ruby. Ruby too. I'm a galactic gumshoe. A good one. Yeah. Coming! Oh my, look at you. I am the Bulldog. Yes, I'm certain you are. I would like speak to Mr. Rodon Kapoor. Come in, please. Thank you. Oh, my, oh, my. Oh, uh, please, be seated. I'll fetch Rodan. Rodan? What now, mother? A distinguished-looking creature has come to see you. So? A uh, Mr. Bulldada. The Bulldada? Uh, I'm not home. Oh, lordy, lordy, Rodan, what have you done this time? Nothing, mother. I have a headache and cannot receive any distinguished-looking creatures this afternoon. I'll give you a headache. Ow! Now get down there and talk to him. Yes, mother. But if he tears me from limb to shining limb, you're going to have to clean it up. Limb to shining? What kind of talk is that? Get down there. Scoot! Mr. Kapoor. <laughs> Hello. What an, an unexpected honor to have my uh, humble abode visited by the Volvada. <laughs> we have not heard from you for some time now. Oh, well, uh, busy, you know how it is. Mother, would you get the phone? Mother! <sighs> ah, okay. Hello, the uh, R.S. Kapoor resident. Mr. Kapoor. Uh oh. This is big money. I know, I know. I would like to know what 
what you found out about the windowing of the No, no! Oh, we don't need any windows today. <laughs> what does she mean, Kapoor? What does she <laughs> You know that it don't help women with money. I didn't pay all money. that money to be what stuttered money, at, Kapoor? Mr. Kapoor. Money? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. So will soul out the bold here it comes. You'd deliver, deliver? What is that to deliver? Yeah. My arms and legs, that's what. No one crosses big money. Understand? All too well, yes. Good. Bye. Kapoor. Oh! <laughs> yeah. You sold us out. Well, in a subtle manner of speaking, yes. The Bulldada Gentle People. Gentle. The Bulldada Forgiving People. Forgiving. The Bulldada People with a sense of humor. Humor! <laughs> I, I like humor. No longer follow the old ways. The old ways, yes, the old ways. Our ancestors would have torn you from limb to shining, shining limb. I, I know, I, I know. If you tell the Tika or Big Money or anyone, Anything more. <laughs> you get my point. Got it. <laughs> oh.